Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. Check me out. And that's Strongman. I am about halfway through right now. A ten-hour video of that was more than a little weird. Do I have do I have audio? Okay, there's the audio. Is he saying stuff? I just put my headphones on. I mean, I'm not watching it all at once. Just like an email here, an email there. I'd be surprised how. I'm ready for my close-up. You'd be surprised how fast you get through five hours of females, and I don't think I have to explain to you what a female is if you're watching this video. So, watching lots and lots of Strong Bad made you wonder whatever happened to his video game? Because I remember it was a Telltale, and Telltale had some issues with Steam where they pulled some of the stuff off and you couldn't get it anymore. But I checked. I wonder if my frames per second can handle all this action. And uh, it was there. So I said, hey. Let's partake in some something other than and GTA. Now, what's this? Awesome. Should we just keep seeing how much he does? That's the kind of thing that you would expect from. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, I guess we didn't. Save load. Settings. Quit it. Quit it. No, you quit it, strong man. Scenes from the next episode. Okay, let's just try a new no, game. No game. No. Sneak it. Save. Sneak it. Quit it. Quit it. Quit it. Save it. Quit it. No game. No. Sneak it. Save. Save. That's just the thing you have to do. No game. Can you click anywhere else? Strong yeah, beds. No game. No game. <laughs> You game. Okay. <laughs> you game. You game. You game. You Okay, so here we are. At Wait, is it my turn? Here we are at Strong Beds. Cool game for attractive people. Episode 1 Homestar Ruiner. No, no, no game. No game. Race for a new game. Should we have done the tutorial? I'm thinking not. Uh, rhino, rhino feeder. Uh, oh, I, 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 I was dreaming about muffins. I wake up every morning feeling awesome. Even though I slept on the remote again last night. Ow, time to tear up another day. This strong bad freaking way. Like an imploding star, like a burning car. My style shines so bright. Please stop trying. To handle my style, cause you can't. No, you can't. Uh, handle my style. Seriously, quit trying to handle my style. Unless you're a lady, oh. then you're cordially invited to have a giant slice of my style. I'm gonna check my email, my email, my email. I'm gonna check my what? Dear Strongbad, I've got a question. If you hate Homestar so much, why don't you just beat the snot out of him? Are you chicken or something? Confust, N-E-M, Frenchtown, California. First of all, I don't think a Frenchie like yourself is in any position to be calling anyone chicken. Comprendez-vous, cordon bleu? Secondly, I'm pretty sure I don't want to beat the snot out of Homestar. I mean, have you ever listened to the guy? He's obviously got a lot of gunk up there. I could probably handle beating the tar, the stuffing, or the into next week out of him, though. I bet I could find Homestar down at Coach Z's track, running in place or something. Okay, so how do we do this? The inventory? We have nothing. Oh, okay, so we, we can walk him around. Calendar. Today's the day I finally give Homestar his long overdue pummeling. I can't unplug the Lappy. It takes five to seven business days to fully charge the battery. Lappy don't charge on weekends. I put up that sign, but the stupid walls are still loafing all the time.
That's where I keep discs 1 through 24 of all my favorite games. P quest. Okay, what if we click on the lappy? I'm checking emails from awesome to awesome. Okay, that's the pummeling email. Take a photo. Yeah. The map. Let's see. Now, where should I put the track on my map? Let's close this because I don't know what I'm doing. Hey, strong son, you in there? Yes. Come on, let me in. I just want to punch you a few hundred times. Not interested. Hit me with your best food shot, fridge of mine. The only thing in here is some paleolithic fluffy puff mayonnaise. Looks like some fat buddy needs to go to the store. It was my turn last time. We can't take it? Ew, that mayonnaise is so ancient, its expiration date is chiseled on a stone tablet. Alright, so we can't take the mayonnaise. <coughs> this is Charlemagne, Strongsad's plant. It used to be healthy, but after Strongsad started talking to it, it decided to kill itself. That's not true. That's not what the note said. I can't use the wavy mic. Its doors stuck shut with nacho entrails and mangled action figures. That makes sense. I'll do the dishes once our skeet shooty flinger gets fixed. Mm, melo we, we, let's go over here. Melonade? <coughs> CD spinner? Oh my goodness. Let's just see what's in the old <coughs> CD. Excuse me. Oh, it's Strong Sad's copy of the best of Brit Pout, the 90s years. Sounds like Coach Z has forced another one of his demos unto the world. You gotta see it when Strong Mad shotguns one of these things. That smoke detector hasn't had a battery since that day I made Strong Sad eat a 9 volt po' boy. Sometimes, I like to stand in front of my window and start flexing in case a girls volleyball team is walking by. The loneliest goat sees the last sunset last. That's a horse. That's from one of the females. So is this, I believe. The cheat. Watch your freaking back, Squeaky. Man, that's one intimidating hush puppy. The Luxa Lounger is even more comfortable in its ridiculously overextended mode. Okay, should we go to the basement? Penance? Those are penance from various academic institutions, unaccredited and discredited alike. That's crazy go nuts university. The cheat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever. Hey, look at that thing over there. <laughs> Only Strong Sad seems to know the secrets of these mysterious mechanical devices. How you doing in there, the cheat? <laughs> hey, do you kiss your hot mom with that mouth? <laughs> Anything over here? I know that was in the, the couch was in the basement. Hey, it's that infomercial for the Ab Aber 2000. It claims you can get a nine pack in less than 40 scribbles a day.
keep on keeping my butt print warm for me, Couch. All right, looks like that's Yay. about it. Oh, he got out. We'll let the cheat not be in the dryer. It's a simple game so far. We're not hitting a lot of... You know what I need to add some much needed hua to my day? A little thing I like to call Teen Girl Squad. Teen Girl Squad! <laughs> Cheerleader! So and so! What's your face? The ugly one! Okay, gals and gal related girls, we fit to look so good! Yeah, I say! At the sub JV basketball game tonight, all the cute boy pieces will be there! And maybe sloppy seconds for you! Okay, let's, let's, let's turn the music off. Let's see, how does this work? Help? So, collect and drag an idea icon from the bottom of the screen to a teen girl and watch the results. Using combinations of ideas or using ideas in different scenes can produce new outcomes. Try to get rid of all of our all, of all four teen girls before the end of the game for maximum points. Okay, so a basketball on the kid girl. I can practice my moves on this basketball. Oh, hey, basketballer. I know it's the wrong sport, but we can still get to first base. You don't got next. Oh. Phew. Better put on some sunscreen. Ooh, SPF negative 50. Walking is like a fashion show for shoes. Gotta make sure my cover-up isn't flaking. Nope, horrible scarring acne is safely concealed. Alternative energy source! This is so good for the environment! <laughs> okay, so we got rid of one. Put one on me, basketballer! Who are you talking to? Oh, what? Uh, that's what I'd say. If a boy was here. Ugh. Later on the game! Uh-oh, girl types. Gotta look good to spy my hairless legs. Nothing impresses like a chest pass. He's on fire! Boys love pubescence perfume! Oh, Accentuate the awkward! Cover your lungs, everyone! I gotta crisp these bangs up with some ozone killer hairspray! I'm almost out of things. Ding doodling doodling! It's a text message! Maybe it's a boy! No, just me. <laughs> it's over! Ugh. Zero points! Okay, so there's a lot of uh, replayability there. Man, I can never get enough of that sassy, injury-prone Teen Girl Squad. The only thing that could possibly make their adventures even more unfortunate would be if I used those really cool Teen Girl Squad ideas I jotted down last night after a fried chicken pizza bender. Hey, what happened to all my really cool Teen Girl Squad ideas? Metal detector? All right, the Tarantula Black Metal Detector! I had to sell like 500 magazine subscriptions to get this baby, but it was totally worth it to be able to shoot radioactive positrons into the Earth's crust in search of rusty pennies. Ooh, inventory! Fun machine? Must punch snakes. Okay, show me that logo! Do, 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 do. Ding. Awesome! Snake Boxer 5! So much better than the unfortunate Snake Boxer 4. Lady Snake Parade.
stupid snake. Upper blow. Kapow. Ugh. Look at me in the eye, brows. <laughs> it's just like a big bundle of mini games. When will I get to the maxi game? Taste my glove, Snakey. Your cobra style is no match for the way of the drunken five pixel power punch. Take that! <laughs> Why is this fun? Body punch! Because it's fun in the way old games were fun. The good games. I did not just get beat by a stupid snake. Unless it was one of them two-headed freak show snakes. Then it's an honor. I have three lives. I don't see a way to quit. Ooh, right in the face. Man, that was easy. Who we get the red one now? Can we beat the entire game? My hand slipped off the controller! It's actually taking skill now. Take that! Stop trying to get the first base with me! <laughs> Body punch! Where's the hot girl that tells me what round it is? Oh, I see her. I think she's that box. Okay, there's five knockouts, do you ring think? Ring the bell! Ring the bell! Is this my last life or my second to last life? Oh dear, this one bites harder. The black border is really great in how it lets you imagine a crowd cheering you on. Ooh. I don't think I'm going to win this. I am actively trying to win this. Your Cobra style is no match for the way of the drunken five-pixel power punch! Man, that was hard! Oh no, there's a purple one! I quit! Oh, there you go, I couldn't get to oh, the purple man. one. I do quit. That was awesome! The only thing that could make Snake Boxer 5 even cooler is using that secret code to unlock the game's controversial hidden mode. It's a good thing I wrote down the code in the manual right over... Hey, who took my Snake Boxer 5 manual? Think that's a side quest? That's my Videlectrics poster that I got for sending in 10 bucks to become a member of the Videlectrics Good Graphic Kateers. These are things that happen. It's possible that my bed's under there, but I'm not touching it to find out. How do we leave? I've had just about enough of that. Let's see what else is in there. Oh, joy. It's that copy of Jane's ostentatious chamber music jam. I'd like to use this CD as a chamber pot. Mr. Darcy! <laughs> that's, that's extremely erudite. You, <laughs> to outside. 
a box. You must click everything. Ah, uh, no. Anything in the mail? Check out my snail mail, check out my snail mail. Mmm, what's this? I'm ready for the big heist. Those smoky red laser beams don't stand a chance when I'm in this getup. Mmm, I think I'll put it in my fancy schmancy trans-dimensional photo booth wardrobe. You costume item. Find your way to the photo booth to wear this item and take fancy fancy pictures suitable for emailing to your friends. Let's see. Now, where should I put the track on my map? Okay, literally, we can just put it anywhere. Okay, so how do I go there? Alright, Homestar. I'm not sure why this never occurred to me before, but some French guy said I should beat you up. And I tend to think he's right. Put up your dukes! Oh, hello, strong man. Are you here to watch the race? What are my options here? You wouldn't happen to know what happened to my Snake Boxer 5 manual, would you? I borrowed some of it from Strong Sad to read on the train. And by train, I mean toilet. Gross! But then I gave it to Marzipan for some papier machapie project she's working on. Grosser! Paper mache? A race? You mean like a race race? Race race race? You haven't heard about the free country USA triannual race to the end of the race? It's only the coolest and most important sporting event in the history of sporting events I'm about to compete in ever! A race, eh? You know, beating you in a race would be almost as much fun as beating you senseless. I'd like to see it twice, Strong Man. I've been training my tweets off for weeks now. And besides, Marzipan has promised me a big victory party after I win. Did someone say, party? Oh, heck yeah. Marzipan's putting together a huge party with floats and cake jugglers and balloon manimals and- And why was I, Lord High Awesome Party, occasionally known as Strong Bad, not invited? Whisperingly, I don't think Marzipan likes you very much. Come on, that party will be deader than a million doornails without me. I'll see if I can get you on the list. Did someone say, party? Oh, heck yeah. Marzipan's putting together okay, a huge so we're party a loop with floats now. and cake jugglers and balloon manimals and- And why was I, Lord High Awesome Party, occasionally known as Strong Bad, not invited? Whisperingly, I don't think Marzipan likes you very much. You know, I bet I could win this race. That's cute. Keep dreaming, tiny legs. He has a point. You know, I bet I could win this race. That's cute. Keep dreaming, tiny legs. Okay, so what do we do now? All this race talk has intrigued me. I believe I will postpone your pummeling. For now. Did it freeze? Pummeling? Hold on, I gotta take this. Yes, Marzipan? Yes? 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 No, yes, yes. I miss you too, Puddin' Sack. Puddin See sack. you after the race. Bye. Girlfriend troubles? Not me, bro. Marzipan just wanted my opinion on the decorations. And the cake jugglers. And the play of the lowland toad weasel. It's a bit... Did it... Pardon me. I'm off to the locker room to reacquire my game face. I've got half a mind to go over to Marzipan's and give her a piece of the rest of my mind about not inviting me to her sucko party. But where should I put her house on my map? Let's close and look around here for a bit more.
That's a big old tub of H2O, just like Mama used to make. Hmm, looks like Code Z's got the time to beat. Hey, don't mess with that camera. It's a sensitive instrument. Heavy Lord. Hey, Coach Z, what's this Heavy Lord for? That's for the second leg of the race to the end of the race. The pogo stick while carrying a Heavy Lord leg. Ah, yes, of course. How silly of me. I got no time for your shenanigans, strong bad. Shut up, Coach Z. What's the good word? No time for jibbers or jabbers right now, strong bad. I gotta make sure this race goes off without a hitch. Tell me more about this race of which you speak. Haven't you heard? It's time for the Free Country USA triannual race to the end of the race! Oh, what now? You know, the F-C-U-T-R-E-R! -E Every three years, the greatest athletes in the world gather to pit their pits against the most grueling obstacle course devised by man or beast. All in the hopes of winning the coveted Free Country USA Triannual Race to the End of the Race Silver Trophy of Ultimate Destiny! You mean the F-C-U-T-R-E-R-S-T-U-D? The Fakutra Stud! Exactly! <laughs> After talking to my bad buddy Homestar, I, Strong Bad, have decided to compete and dominate the Free Country USA Triannual Race to the End of the Race! Where's that starting line? Well, now that's gonna be a bit of a problem, Strong Bad. The deadline for entering the race was over a month ago. What? In fact, there are only two official entrants in this year's race. Homestar and Pom Pom. Not exactly a clash of the titans there, coach. Yeah, maybe we should have put up some flyers or something. So all a guy has to do is win a stupid race to get that really kick-awesome trophy? Not even close! In order to prove themselves worthy of the Free Country USA Triannual Race to the End of the Race Silver Trophy of Ultimate Destiny, da -da -da -da, you gotta beat the best time of all the PREVIOUS trophy winners! Well, that sucks. What's the best time? As it just so happens, yours truly got the best time, way back in 1999. Check it out! Okay, so if a guy beats your time, and everyone else's time, then he gets the trophy, right? You'd think so, wouldn't you? But no! After the times have been posted, I have to send a recording of the race to the official review committee in Stockholm for verification. Then, and only then, is a new free country yada 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 champion crowned! Swedes, I hate those guys! <laughs> this is, this is good. I, I, I intended to have a little more commentary up to this point, but I'm just enthralled. Just to summarize for all the kids playing at home, all a guy's got to do to win that trophy is... A. Win the race. Check. 2. Beat your time. Yep. And Z. Wait for you to send in the video of the race so the results can be officially sanctioned by a bunch of meatball-loving Swedes. You got it. Come on, man! Let me in the race! Rules are rules, Strong Bad. Only Homestar and Pom Pom will be allowed to compete in the Free Country USA Triannual Race to the end of the race! Come on, man! Let okay. me in the race! Rules are rules, Strong Bad. Only Homestar and Pom Pom will be allowed to compete in the Free Country USA Triannual Race to the end of the race! Just to summarize for all the kids Okay, we've home, exhausted all this. All a guy's got to do to win that trophy <sighs> is... A. Win the race. Check. 2. Beat your time. Yep. And Z. Wait for you to send in the video of the race so the results can be officially sanctioned by a bunch of meatball-loving Swedes. I love you meatballs. I, I love meatballs as much as anybody. Just, just put that out there. These stands are emptier than a striper concert. Oh! That's, that's mean. All the muffling in the world won't make those speakers sound any better. Hey, don't go messing with my booming system. 
Don't touch that turtle. Don't touch that turtle. Sometimes you gotta touch the turtle. We just take the trophy? That's one cretaceously big trophy. It dang well should be. That's the silver trophy of ultimate destiny. <laughs> awarded to the winner of the Free Country USA triannual race to the end of the race. Of course it is. Curdled milk. Don't touch that curdle with the milk. Why would that, that be part of the... Don't touch that hurdle. Don't touch that hurdle. Okay, so that seems to be it for now. Have we explored everything that is to be here? With no real hint as to how we are going to... Okay, so this is me clicking as fast as I can. I don't think he can beat the time of 22 seconds. A pogo stick. Hey, don't be fiddling with that Pogliacci stick. That's a big old tub of H2O. Just like Mama used to make. I think we have to go to the map. Well, look at that. To the map. I guess we have to go to Marzipan. Don't touch the balloons. Do you know how hard it is to find eco-friendly mylar? They're very hard. Loose dirt. Hey, where'd your stupid ficus go? I was gonna pee on it. I've temporarily transplanted Credenza indoors so that he won't get trampled or peed on by clumsy partygoers. I think this little patch of ground's already horked up its share of treasure today. Okay, that was at least a thought. I'm back here, Strong Bad. Okay, if you just hold down, he just walks. That looks good. Hey! I heard an ugly rumor that there's going to be a party here and I'm not invited. Oh, that's not a rumor. Good! It's a cold hard fact. <laughs> Why? Do you remember what happened the last time I invited you to a party? Behold! I am Lord Burglebroth! Come for your souls! All will kneel before my style! Look out! <laughs> I still don't see why I can't come to your stupid party that I hate. Well, I was willing, but Homestar said no way. Parenthetically, I don't think he likes you very much. I heard an ugly rumor that there's going to be a party okay. here and I'm not invited. Oh, that's not a rumor. Good. It's a cold hard fact. Why? Can I exit? Do you remember what no. happened the last time I invited you to a party? Nope, can't exit. Behold, I am Lord Burglebroth. Come for your souls. All will kneel before my style. Look out. <laughs> no, not really. That figures. Okay, let's ask about the manual. Homestar tells me that you've got my Snake Boxer 5 manual. Oh, yeah. I was going to use it in my Homestar float. Ah! Not to worry. I gave the manual to Coach Z. He likes to look at the pictures. Okay, so that means we can go back to Coach Z and then get the manual. Hey, look at the invisible time. Bye now. Bye, Strong Bad. We can still come back to this. So let's go to the map. Let's try to follow a line, a train of thought. Right, so now I should be able. I think, I think I'm getting there. This, this could be a huge game. Cell phone? 
Homestar's cell phone is finally mine! Now I can change all his speed dials? Muhuhaha! I got no time for your shenanigans. Quiet, you! A little bird with a baseball bat head tells me you've got my Snake Boxer 5 manual. Is that what that was? I was using it to scrub my. No, oh, shut up, shut up! But then I sold it to Bub so he could scour his. Ah, I've heard enough! Okay, so we have to get the Bubs. And that might not be today. Let's go back to Marzipan. That's some of the loosest soil I've ever seen. Not that I spend a lot of my time staring at soil or anything. But man, so loose. I think this little patch of ground's already horked up its share of treasure today. All right, well, I mean, that seemed like the logic. Why would I have a metal detector if not for loose soil? That loose soil. That Maybe over here. It. Whoa, that is one seriously ginormous version of Homestar. Do you like it? The paper is made from 100% vegetable products from my prize-winning organic garden. I always suspected Homestar was a big vegetable. <laughs> Victory for Homestar Garden Party. Talk about counting your armless chickens before they hatch. I like to think of it as positive thinking. If I can visualize Homestar winning the race, then he will win the race. You're about to make me start positive puking. I visualized that yesterday. You know, it kinda sorta looks like this party is more about showing off your garden than celebrating Homestar's unlikely racing prowess. Don't be silly, Strombad. I never put the needs of my rhododendrons, marigolds, and okra above those of, um... Homestar. Right, Homestar. Homestar. Mmm, ripe, stinky onions. I better pick a few in case I need to make an emergency stew later on or something. Ooh. The rest of these onions need a few more weeks to blossom into their full, stinky potential. I think this little patch of ground has already horked up its share of treasure today. All right, we need to talk to her to get the next hey. phase. Did you make all these decorations? That's so sweet of you to ask. Why, yes, all of these party decorations were handcrafted by me, myself, and I. I grew the bamboo for the tiki torches in my underground terrarium, ground the paint pigments for the victory banner from a variety of rose petals in my garden, and completed a three-week course in ironworking at the local community college so that I could hand smelt the cute little homestar float over there. Wow, that was a lot of words. I can't believe you're throwing such a big party for such a small brain. Who? Oh yeah, Homestar. Well, I was just planning to throw a big party celebrating my award-winning organic vegetable garden, but no one seemed to want to come to that. So I added Homestar into the mix, and now everyone's coming. Ahem. <clears throat> Almost everyone. Thank you. So this Homestar victory party is just an excuse to show off your garden? It's more like one of the universe's happy synchronicities. Like when a whale eats a fisherman, or you walk into a wall. Hey, I only did that twice! <laughs> when a whale eats a fisherman? Oh, come on, fishermen's... We, we need fishermen. I'm talking like Strongbed. We need the fishermen. Why are you saying that the fishermen are not good? I can't believe you're throwing such a big party for such okay, a small so brain. Who? Oh yeah, Homestar. Well, I was just planning to throw a big party celebrating my award-winning organic vegetable garden, but no one seemed to want to come to that. So I added Homestar into the mix, and now everyone's coming. Ahem. <clears throat> Almost everyone. Thank you. Did you do something different with your hair? I can't even smell it from here. Why, yes, thank you for noticing. I've added just a little bit of muskrat sweat to my usual mixture of henna and flaxseed oil. 
I know what you're thinking. What about the increased viscosity and split ends you usually get with muskrats? Well, here's the secret. Free range muskrats. It's amazing how much high quality sweat you can get out of a muskrat when it's being raised in a loving and stress free environment. Yeah, amazing. So, can I still be staying nice to her? Did you make all these decorations? Yep, we've exhausted That's that. It's so sweet of you to ask. Why, yes. All of these party decorations were handcrafted by me, myself, and I. I grew the bamboo for the tiki torches in my underground terrarium, ground the paint pigments for the victory banner okay, so where do we, how do we get the bubbles in my garden, and completed a three-week course in ironworking at the local community college so that I could hand smelt the cute little homestar float over there. Wow, that was a lot of words. I still don't see why I can't come to your stupid party that I hate. Well, I was willing, but Homestar said okay, no so way. Okay, so that's a repeat. So those are exhausted. I don't think he likes you very much. Is this exhausted? So this Homestar victory party is just an excuse to show off your garden? It's more like that line is also exhausted. Like when a whale eats a fisherman, or you walk into a wall. Hey, I only did that twice. What? What do you have against fishermen? I mean, that's just okay. Nice dorkerations, marzipan. Hey, I've been working on those for a week. Weak is right. Maybe you should have tried working on them for a strong. <laughs> Go away, strong bad. Is there something different about you today? Why, yes. Because I can't really make anything out. The sheen off your oily forehead. It's too blinding. I don't like to use the word hate, so I use the word chonk. I really chonk you, strong bad. I chonk you with the passion of a thousand exploding whales. Exploding whales? Nice dorkeration, Okay, so that's... Hey, I've been working on those for a week. Week is right. Maybe you should have tried working on them for a strong. <laughs> Go away, strong bad. Can you still do niceness? Did you do something different with your hair? I can't even smell it from here. Why, yes, thank you for noticing. I've added just a little bit of muskrat sweat to my usual mixture of henna and flaxseed oil. I know what you're thinking. What about the increased viscosity and split ends you usually get with muskrats? Well, here's the secret. Free range muskrats. It's amazing how much high quality sweat you can get out of a muskrat when it's being raised in a loving and stress-free environment. Yeah, amazing. Um, we've exhausted everything. Hey, look at the invisible time. Bye now. Bye, strong bad. And nothing has triggered me to go to see bubs. And I'm not yet tempted to take a picture. Hey, she won't let you in. So what do we do? Dead end. Dead end. Maybe we have to go home. What's this? The cheats of sorted Latin rhythms? I don't see anything really. Okay, I may be stuck. Could there be a new female? Ah, my trusty steed. Stooley, I'd ride you into email battle any day. I'm just over here checking my email and your breath smells real bad. Two emails. Dear Mr. Bat, my brother and I were wondering whose head is bigger. Yours are home stars. Quizzically, Jay and Jim Rosen, Brooklyn, New York. Hmm, that's a good question. I should go do some field research. Dear Strongman, 
Is it true that you're going to be beating the snot out of Homestar soon? Because I'd like a piece of that action. Taking the under over, Dan O'Meara. Country Croc, Ireland. Okay, well, we, we've unlocked another email. But nothing really says... Okay, well, I'm supposed to go compare myself to Homestar's head. And that's, he's at the track. Trying to unlock the new location of Bubs. But he's not here. I got no time for your shenanigans, strong bad. Gorsh, I couldn't do it. My turn. Just to summarize for all the kids playing no, at home. nothing new. All the guys got A. Checked. Yep. And Z. Oh, I found out how to bypass it. You, you right click. Is it right click the solution for so many things? Um, I'm gonna be honest, guys. I'm kind of like, what do I do now? What do you think? Where do we go to unlock another thing so I can get my... That might be just too much of a side quest. What am I missing and why is this dirt? Nah. The cell phone. Well, this is options. I'll be for Bubs. Hi, hello, people. Welcome to Bubs Concession Tuesday. For calendars, press one. For tie-ons, press eight. For support holes, press star. You can't prank a phone tree. Besides, the last time I navigated Bub's telestand, I wound up with a crate full of rhino horns. And not even the endangered kind. Pom 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 pom. Hello there, Balloon Man. This is Homestar one -oh. Please don't be me too bad. We in the waste to the end of the waste today, okay? Okay, so we're eliminating people. Only an amateur tries to make a prank phone call while standing within earshot of the pranky. Hello, attractive women. You've reached strong bad. If you're not an attractive woman, Please hang up the phone. If you are an attractive woman, please purchase a hot tub and some pork rinds and invite me over. See you in your dreams. That, that, that. Hi, Swangbad. This is Homestow. I'm an attractive woman and I bought a hot tub. Come on over. He pranked himself. That was more than a little weird. <laughs> more than. This could be good. Hey there, you've reached the cordless shell phone, and definitely not the public payphone of Coach Z. Leave me a message after the fat beats. Hello there, Coach. This is Homestyle 1 -oh. I just think you should know that it was me, Homestyle, who's been putting itching powders in your jock strap for the past three years. Well, that should get me off the hook. But the creepy thing is, Coach Z's never actually complained about it. The cheat has a phone? Who knew? <laughs> hey, the cheat, this is totally homestyle. Can you come to my house and gnaw my face off? And steal my boombox and leave it at the drop point? Bye! Sometimes I like to get creative with my mission assignments for the cheat. 
Okay, so we have to leave. So five of seven. So we have to go back to House of Strong. Inventory. Let's see. Speed dial number one. Hamster? Hello, Marzipan. Are you all right? You sound funny. I look funny. I'm just, uh, out of breath from all the training for the race that I've been doing. Okay, so when are you going to run this race anyway? I need to know when to take the curb wrinkles out of the oven. More like crud wrinkles. What was that? Nothing, Lambface. I was just saying that the race is about to start right now. Oh dear, I better hurry on over. Hooray! I'll see you soon. Don't start without me. Bye bye I'm home style. Ah, someone else to prank. Hey, where'd this one come from? Completely meaningless and made my brain throw up. Okay, I'm same a thing. Rudely drawn cupcake. Don't forget your tape sickle. Okay. Let's go to the map. No, the map. And go to the track. Well, that was confusing. I went all the way to the track, but Coach Z said the race probably won't start for a few more hours. Oh well, more time to get my garden ready for the party, I guess. Okay, so we didn't really gain much out of that, did we? Beside the prank. I'm a little bit stuck here, gang. Like, you, you've clicked on everything, and is there anything new from Coach Z? I couldn't all- Not interested. Come on, man. Let me in the race. Rules are rules, strong man. Only Homestar and Bobby. So that's a waste of time. Not that all of this isn't a waste of time. Give Coach Z an onion. Gorsh, I couldn't have ordered a better day. No one cares. Uh, no. So I don't know what's a, a stew. He mentioned no a stew. Way. You're not going to make a stew and they let me get an onion stew in the water? Did I miss something at Marzi Pants? Okay, so we've pranked all the people. Tra -la 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 -la. Could we plant onions in the other loose ground? How come Homewad gets a float? Because he's my boyfriend. This week, anyway. How come Homewad gets a? Because he's my. How come home? Because he's my boy. Alrighty, just I. I think we've. I don't know. I feel like I've exhausted everything, and I have not achieved anything. Nope. That won't do anything interesting. No way. All right, well. Oh, 
Okay, to the map. Let's go back to the House of Strong and prank people. So that's like a thing. What is it now, Homestar? I think they're really ready to start the race this time. Are you sure? Positive! Fine, I'll be right over. Okay, how many times do we have to do this? And it is a thing to do. All this pointless walking back and forth to the track is really starting to zest my lemon. Okay, what if we call her? Homestar, I'm not sure if- It's okay, Mousypan. This time, Coach Z himself says it's time to start the race. Oh yeah, the Roars is aboard to start any morning. You betcha. All right, I'm on my way. Wait, right now we're here. We should get to see her arrive, right? That's a big old tub of H2O, just like Mama used to make. Or do I have to leave and then come back so that she, you don't see her arrive, you see her leave pissed off? Mozipan? I'm on my way. Okay, this is a little bit game saved. Okay, well, let's go back to the map. Well, that was confusing. I went all the way to the track, but Coach Z said the race probably won't start for a okay, few more it's, hours. It's just, oh well, more time loop. to get my garden ready for the party, I guess. So, I'm at the point now where I really don't know what to do next. Um, I'm missing something here. So, I think I'll take a break. Come back to this with a, a fresh look at some point. Yes, that's that's probably best. I will say this, it looks like there's a lot more content here than I than I would have expected. And this could be this could be a lot of a lot of gaming. There could be a lot of game to game here. So on that note, uh, this is your strong bad. Have a great night. <laughs>